Hello guys! In this video, we will be discussing about transforming general form equation of a parabola to the standard form equation. So this is an example of a general form equation of a parabola. Now our goal is to transform this into standard. How to do that? Now first thing to do is to regroup, meaning to say we are going to group terms that bear the same variable. So at this point, we are going to regroup 5y squared and negative 30y. So 5y squared minus 30y. So the variable that bears an exponent of 2 must be dominating or occupying the left side of the equation, which means to say that 2x will be transposed to the right. So this is now negative 2x minus 49. Now, on the left side, we are going to factor out the common. What's the common of 5 and negative 30? 5. Okay? 5 is actually the common, so let that out from the equation. So, 5 times y squared minus 6y. So if we're going to distribute 5 to every term of the function inside the parentheses, 5 times y squared is 5y squared, 5 times negative 6y is negative 30y. And then we are going to um, copy the right side. Now from here we are going to transform the function inside the parentheses into a perfect square trinomial. So we are going to complete the square. How to do that? Pick the numerical coefficient beside the y variable, which is negative 6. Then always divide by 2. This is true to all. What is the quotient? Negative 3. If we are going to square that, the product will be 9. So negative 3 times negative 3, that's positive 9. This is now the value that we are going to add to make it a perfect square trinomial. So we have here 5 times y squared minus 6y plus 9 is equal to negative 2x minus 49. Now, if you add something on the left, please add also on the right side to maintain the balance or the equality. Now, you know that you add 9, but there is still 5. So what is 5 times 9? That's 40. Five. So please add also 45 on the right side. Now, this one can be factored, meaning to say we can now employ the process of factorization because this is special product. Okay, how to factor? Now, from this, let's go back to our process. What is now the value inside the parentheses? That's negative 3. Take that. So this is now y minus 3 squared. It means to say that if we're going to expand y minus 3 squared, the expansion will be y squared minus 6y plus 9. So the factored figure of y squared minus 6y plus 9 is y minus 3 squared. And so simplifying the right side, so just copy negative 2x, negative 49 plus 45, that is actually negative 4. And then from here, um, we will be um, factoring out the common. What's the common of negative 2 and 4? Negative 2. So let that out. Negative 2 times x plus 2. So if you're going to distribute negative 2 times x, that's negative 2x. Negative 2 times positive 2, that's negative 4. So this one and this one are just equal. We are just factoring. Now in terms of the right side, just copy. But at this point, we are going to divide both sides with 5. Also divide here with 5. In short, what's left on the left side, this is now y minus 3 squared. And you can let negative 2, negative 2 over 5 be on the same um, point. So we have here negative 2 over 5. You can actually detach 5 and be the denominator of negative 2. And then this is x plus 2. So this is now our standard form equation of our 
parabola having the center negative 2, positive 3. Thank you for watching.